one of the things to become a fully diverse and inclusive company, individuals need to take responsibility for it. From the top at companies, CEOs need to buy in. And it's really important in terms of retaining the best talent for a company. So when we're thinking about forming teams, when we're thinking about making appointments to our teams, we've got to all really think about how diverse we can make them if we really, really, really want them to be effective and innovative. And we want to be effective and innovative because those are the core ingredients to enabling us as a company to grow faster. Companies that do good, meaning do the right things, are fair and value all employees, also have stronger financials. It's really important that people understand that they can actually invest in these companies and it's important that they can invest with their values and have strong returns. Understand that every investment makes an impact. That impact can be positive, but it can also be negative. We can align our values with our investment portfolios as well and make the long-term nature of our return stream line up with the long-term nature of sustainability of investing in good businesses. Go to the areas that you want to work in. Um, don't think that creating solutions for farmers in Kenya um, is something you could do out of DC or New York. Speak to companies on the ground. We're always willing to educate as many people as possible to make sure that when you're trying to move the world forward, you at least have the context and the framework. Every part of the ecosystem is willing to work together. So we had large private sector, uh, we had large data aggregator, we had the United Nations, and you had a startup based in Kenya. But the way we look at ESG and the way we look at making the world a better place is very intertwined. And I think that common thread was the biggest takeaway for, for everybody today. Thomson Reuters and the Thomson Reuters Foundation are both doing phenomenal work, really groundbreaking initiatives that provide a platform for employees, for clients, for partners to make a difference um, and to really engage on some of these big challenges of the day. As consumers, to be more aware of the supply chain and where our products are coming from, I think is one of the most important things. When you see something, say something, report it, it makes you feel uneasy if you think there may be some kind of slave labor or human trafficking involved, to get that out there to the appropriate you know, parties so that they can address it effectively. Big issues like climate change and modern slavery are complex, and our role is very diverse and different, but there's, a, there's an action item for everyone. So finding out more, don't be shy about reaching out to the people that you heard from today and finding out how you can spread the word. If every person walks away from this event with one key action item and a clear path to pursuing it, it'll be a great success.